Hello, Leos. How are you guys? I hope all is well. <clears throat> I am Phoenix Rising. If you're hearing my voice, I see my big old head. You're watching my channel. You are welcome, Cross Watchers Leos. I am here to do a, a general read for you. So this is not love. This is not career. It's whatever you see to put it. So I'll let you put it wherever it fits. If it sound like your baby daddy, your baby mama, your stupid job, or your good man, your good, I don't know. Just put it. Let go. Okay? Go the rest of the way. Um, if it don't apply, let it fly. That's why it's going to be for another Leo. It is general. It's not personal. So remember that as well. To book me for a personal read or cash out your donation, it is in the description box or on my page. Okay? Okay, okay. And we're going to pray first. High power source. We ask that you protect us. You guide us. We ask that you cleanse us and heal us of all toxicity. All Leo's watching. We ask that you step in and send your four corner angels, Gabriel, Raphael, Uriel, Michael, to give us messages, ethers, and ancestors, please, spirit, for the zodiac sign Leo, for the collective that watched me for cross watchers. I ask that you send the ethers, my ancestors, and my own angels to give me messages. In a higher power's name, we pray. We are nothing without you. Amen. I think the card turned over. Sure did. All right, so what's who, 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 who keeping a secret from y'all? Okay, you got the moon in reverse, instability, silence. Someone cannot be talking, but there's some unveiling of some type of secret. I'm gonna pull four cards from this deck and then I'm gonna get confirmation. This is releasing of fears, subsiding, some type of fucking truth coming to the light. Something that was hidden with the moon, deception, lies, treachery, fuckery. Okay, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, fucking energy. Someone was lying. Someone's hiding something from you, Leo. Someone's a liar in your life. Yeah. Somebody could be in jail that's a liar, too. That's crazy. Okay? Right, take it as it resonates. It's just, it's, 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 it gets crazy in here. Give me three more cards for Leo, please. General read. Spirit, three more cards for Leo. General read. The Hermit. This is um Virgo energy. This is like self-searching, meditation, retreat, uh, like, like silence. Keep it to yourself. Deep thought. Isolation. Okay? Not wanting to be bothered. I don't know if it's somebody you're dealing with or this is your energy. Maybe right now you're in hermit mode. Maybe you're in deep thought. Because hermit, hermit is definitely like studying or reading or watching readings or I don't know. There's something you get some type of insight, wisdom with, with the uh, higher, I mean the higher fine. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Higher fines. The hermit. <laughs> the hermit. This is um, spiritual awakening, contentment, soul searching, self-awareness, self-reflection. Like what do I need to change? I need to get that shit together. They did say I was acting like, I don't know though. Am I, I might be. Self-reflection. You made some bad decisions. There's some type of addiction. I don't know if you're dealing with or somebody else dealing with. This is abuse, drugs, temptation, um, hopelessness, and decisions and secrets, nightmares, substance abuse, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. The Seven of Cups in reverse is the energy of um, reality check. Like, boom, damn, this shit is like that. So-and-so really that fucked up. I hate to say it like that, but that's what I feel like somebody said. Or they really don't care about me. Or they really don't fuck with me. Or they said that shit. Like the Seven of Cups is like, um, yeah, this is something you might have avoided. I think you kind of knew. I don't know, job, person, place, career. I don't know. The job was fucking you over. The person went right. Somebody, someone right. And this is a reality check, an indecision. Now you feel trapped with the situation. Either you're trapped at the job. You're like, fuck, I got to keep working here to pay my bills. Oh, I got to stay in this relationship because so-and-so live here and we codependent. Uh, I, I don't know. Or oh, this kid got to stay here because they this is my kid and they they grown ass. I don't know. I don't know. Give me one more card. Old grief. Five of cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. Moving on. Acceptance. Forgiveness. Healing. Moving forward. Accepting help. What do you need help with? Five, five of cups. Something. Somebody fucked you over three times already. This is a pain that keeps coming. The two of cups behind you is like you. It's still hope for the shit. You just need to. Be smart about it. Crazy part is I meant to start with y'all angel messages. I want to write about it right over. The world is here though, which means this is a blessing, abundance. So this is a good relationship coming, good money coming, good something coming, good job coming. It could be all three. You don't fucking know. This is fulfillment. This is your this is your energy. This is Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius, Taurus. This is like uh accomplished. You know, you're gonna accomplish something. Whether it's in love or career, you're gonna get the golden nugget. This is 
um, sense of belonging. So I feel like maybe in some situations, a job, four, or five, six on the clock, maybe you felt like you didn't belong or you shouldn't have been there. Or this wasn't for you or this person wasn't for you. Conflict, confliction. You feel you're suffering from type of uh, confliction. Let me do the angel messages because I'm, 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 I don't like to do shadow orders. It's kind of throwing me off that I didn't do it. So I'm gonna pull four cards real quick and then I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go back and get confirmation for all of those. <clears throat> four cards, spirit for Leo, general reading. Four cards, angel messages. <clears throat> you know you can do it. Don't know what you think you can't do, but Spirit said, you, look at the bell. It's all right because you say about a bell, too. You, you can do the shit. You can do it. I don't know what you think you can't do, but Spirit said you can. Listen to your own inner strength, the own, your own inner voice. Your knowledge is your, your inner knowing within you. Okay? It's all within you. Next chord. Seeing a rainbow is a sign from your loved ones in spirit. Ooh, that's beautiful. Did you see a rainbow? Last card. Only think positive thoughts as your desires are manifested, which you think is what happens with 606 on the clock, okay? It becomes a reality. So if you think thinking bad shit, here it comes. You think thinking good shit, here it comes. I just seen one, so it's talking about a new beginning. And then you got, oh, your soul has your soul has made many journeys. Listen to its wisdom, the bottom of the deck. That means don't listen to your head. Listen to your soul. It's a whole different voice. Okay, so now I got to go back to the cards. I'm Earl Okay. Why is the moon here in reverse for Leo? General read, what is this secret? Some type of deception, some type of releasing of fears, unveiling of secrets. Leo, General Reed. Why is that here, spirit? Why is that here? Ooh, the four cups in reverse, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. Something you're trying to keep control of with the Emperor's energy here. You can be dealing with an Emperor in your life. This could be a male figure that wants to boss up, or it could be a female, but this is someone that likes to take control and be in charge of the situation, okay? The four cups is a uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. This is definitely focus on the good and letting go of the bad, okay? So someone said something and they okay so someone unveiled a secret or you found some shit out right so with the four of cups it's like they want you to let this shit go okay they want you to not you know don't be look at that. they want you to be motivated to re-energize they don't want you to be stuck they want you to let them let go and they're trying to control your emotions okay if somebody you committed to with the higher font you committed to a situation a job a person five is conflict though so there's some type of chaos crisis conflict instabilities the hierophant is committed. So they want their commit. They're trying to be committed to making you stay or believe this. With the emperor, this is someone that wants full fucking control of the situation. It's Scorpio energy. The emperor is also a, a I don't know, paternity test? Stable, in, independent, protective. Your baby daddy. Your husband. I don't know. Your a significant other. Your boss at the job. Your job can have a lot of fucking secrets with the emperor here. The emperor is a boss. So it could be the job. Some hidden secrets, but they don't want to let your ass go. They're trying to hold on to your ass. I don't know. Hermit. Why is the hermit here? Upright. The hermit is here. Why is the hermit here for Leo? Please, spirit. Why is the hermit here for Leo's hermit? Uh, the Ten of Swords in reverse. Somebody backstabbed you, and you worried about your money. Did someone take your money? Someone took your money? Someone played you about money? Someone stiffed you on some money? I don't know. The Ten of Swords give me an energy of someone played about some money. This is you rising above problems. Okay, pulling yourself together. Yeah! Someone played you with some money. Will of Fortune here in reverse? The Will of Fortune is bad luck with money. Bad luck with love. Give me somebody you love. The Hierophant did. Did, did somebody sneak off? Somebody? The fuck? The Hierophant is definitely sneaky. Like, uh, uh, if it was upright, it's just like mystery. You know, someone that maybe um you see is a good person but the higher fight in reverse is definitely sneaky creepy secrets okay this is pisces cancer scorpio and this is unwanted some of y'all might not have gave this person no sex or some of sexual attention i don't know okay repressed intuition lack of self-belief the will of fortune is a karmic or a bad luck at a job bad luck with an apartment bad this is a bad 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 situation leo scorpio aquarius taurus the will of fortune in reverse is unwelcoming change bad luck uh, uh, upheaval some type of some type of fuckery, some type of setback, some type of destruction. Boom, boom, boom. It came out with the hierophant, I mean a hermit. So this is what got you quiet. 
And the ten of swords, I said, rising above problems. Something with your money, though. Your money not right. Somebody was greedy or selfish. Ooh, you see. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn energy. Somebody was greedy or selfish. And they got you in isolation. You're like, nah, fuck that. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. It's keeping you up at night. Mm-hmm. Yep, they snuck. Who the fuck did? They snuck off with their money. Somebody seven of swords you. And it's, they got you up at night. They either lied, they stole, they cheated on you. They they lied on you. Hey, pull up. I, you pull up, I'll go with you. We can pull up together. I'm a fire sign. I'm a sage. You know, we can, we can go blaze some shit up. No, we supposed to be on a spiritual walk. Damn it. Damn it. <laughs> All right, for real though, no. And about two, three years ago, we could pull up. But now we just got to be prayed up. It's all right. To be honest, let me be for real. Spirit going to get them better. It ain't nothing like spirit getting you, baby. You know, sometimes you just got to wait. I know Medea say you don't be wanting to wait. But you got to wait on that porch. You just got to wait on that. Wait on that, Jesus. Okay, I'm sorry. Okay, look. So the nine of swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, energy. Uh, this is fear, anxiety, a breakdown. You like fuck. Somebody fucking pulling out the edges. They they nervous. Somebody pacing. Somebody biting their nails. I can see my daughter biting her nails. I got a Leo. Oh baby, she probably someone pacing. I can feel it. The Seven of Swords is somebody Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. They they stay coming clean or confess they did something wrong. They're cowardly. Somebody gets the coward way out, getting caught up. I don't know. Mmm. I feel like that. Ooh. Oh. I'm on the roll on the floor. I'm too tired to get up. My big ass gonna be down. Oh Lord, they did me wrong. Who y'all? A A contain the the lion in you, G. For real, this is deep. It's it could be a, it could definitely be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius energy because the Eight of Swords in reverse is definitely um escape freedom. You, this is like you. I gotta find other options because this motherfucker don't even know how to talk to you. This King of Swords is a dictator. They brutal. They aggressive. They rude. They are fucking liar. Oh, they lie so much. It's crazy. Why they always lying? It's, you know, they judge mental. Like, what the fuck? 12, 12 on the clock. All right, so yeah, this three of swords in reverse, obviously, they gonna want to reconcile, okay? They want to release the pain. All they want you to be strong like a Leo. And, oh, forgive thee and move on. And no, 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 no. Spirit, I think these, these, you, 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 you're supposed to release this person. I can't even get out for your turn. They got to go, Leo. With the strength card. You got to move on. You got to move on. You got to find the inner strength. But one, two, three, four on the clock, baby. They got to go. No, they can't say yeah. Not this energy. This person is seven of swords your ass too many times. I can feel it. I want to go. I don't even know. If it's a job, I want to go to get your shit and just take send a car. I pack the box up. You just sit there. Fuck it. If, it, if it's if it's a, if it's an apartment, we got to go get your shit. You know, or they, well, they got to get their shit off the curb at this point. I'm just saying. But they, 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 they treacherous as hell. Now, let's see what this bad decision is. I don't know. The job did you wrong. The cousin, like, this take her, give her back her house keys and get, get your keys back. Yeah, Bookie, this this bad. Okay, hold on. Change your code on your phone. I don't know. Somebody just, they just dirty. They're trying to man fuck you with 13, 14 on the clock. I feel so, so mind fuckery. Um, okay, seven of cups in reverse. The sun in reverse. Ten of Cups in reverse, family situation, breakdown of a something that made you extremely happy. Now it's like making you extremely fucking sad with the sign in reverse. Yeah, oh, you was resistant. You got the judgment card upright in the fucking tower. This person lacks to uh be committed to this. This is a this is not learning from your mistakes. Virgo towards Capricorn energy, okay? This is not someone not dedicated to the team. They like commitment. They bullshit you. The job, whatever it is, they don't, they don't, they, they not into you. They're not, they, they lack commitment towards you, whether it's the job getting you to stay, the person, the cut, they, they bullshit. And like I said, it's, it's like this brought you a lot of sadness, this decision, the sun in reverse. <coughs> Who this is this? Hold on. Uh, 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 okay. <laughs> yeah, this is sadness, okay? The sun is um, Aquarius energy. So it could be an Aquarius making you sad. Um, and this could be a family situation. Like I said, the Ten of Cups is Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. This is some type of uh, conflict, breakdown, upheaval, keeping up for the appearances, family social services involved, dysfunctional family, family secrets. The tower is here, and the tower is here in reverse. So you resist this change. You was trying to hold on. And the universe is like, give it here. 
And I'm just, you know, I'm just okay. And with judgment here, it's like, hey, listen, 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 Linda. Somebody want to renew this. They feel they want forgiveness. I don't know. They want to make it. It's like snap decision. Somebody feel homesick or self evaluation, awakening, renewal, apology. What's up? What's up? Yeah. All right. Let's see. You got um, five of cups in reverse. Why is five of cups here in reverse? Grief. Moving on. Okay. You got two of cups sitting behind it. Two of cups setting up like that. We bowed and bowed. Now the three of cups did fall, but that don't mean a motherfucking thing. That's all I gotta tell you. I don't know what this is. You didn't lost hope in, but. It ain't the end. Somebody wants your forgiveness. Ah, you can forgive, but never forget. That's what spirit say. Just telling you. I'm just telling you. Five of Cups in reverse is ew. They just loyal. They lie, they lie a lot. Somebody. Okay, look now. If this if this is a relationship, they act like they single when you're not around. Right. I'm just. I don't know what the fuck this is. Whatever the job, act like they don't give a fuck about you. Somebody act like they're not your friend when you're not around with the nine of Pentacles. They 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 act like it's just them, you know. It's I don't know how to explain this, but it's a they don't. If it's a friend, they front you. If it's a man, a woman, they they act like they single. If it's a job, they they don't or they don't need you. I, I, it's a it's a down the pinnacle thing. Virgo towards Capricorn energy. It's something you love though, or a person. Okay, it's about independence and maturity, contentment, money stable. I think some of y'all want to be single as well. If you're not. Okay, and then you got the five of wands here. This is Leo's, I mean, six of wands. Shit. Leo, Sagittarius, Aries energy. That is definitely a broken promises. Okay. Um, failure. The fall, the, the, the yeah, weakness. The pride before the fall, the fall before the pride. You know what I'm saying? The pride before the damn fall. Tragedy, tragedy, tragedy. Something you love with a tragedy, 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 tragedy. Yep, wounded warrior in conflict. The job had you in conflict. Oh, some some had you in conflict. The nine of wands is Leo Sagittarius Aries and you're, you're trying to recover, open up. This is the breakdown. This is like self pity, okay? And then somebody had you in conflict with the five of wands, Leo Sagittarius Aries and there was some type of conflict, chaos, crisis, uh, arguing, frustrations. I do not know why I'm here. He has the whole world in his hands. He's got the whole world in his hands. I don't know if that's something y'all listening to. That's what I'm hearing now. Okay, we're gonna get the strength in the world card. Why do we need what's what's up with the strength in the world card for you guys? Okay, the strength card is your card. This is good health, courage, power, uh, action, patience. Okay, this is inner demons you're facing, healing, fitness. Okay, good health. Is you taming that beast inside of you? Look at this lion. I'm getting control, self-evaluation of everything in my life. And the world is at your feet. This is a completion, success. Okay, you could be completing a cycle. Okay, this is um, high obtained rewards. Okay, Recon reconciliation. Someone, someone can want to reconcile. Aquarius, Taurus, uh, Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, and Scorpio fell in my lap. Spirit said, "Take it." All right, yeah, this three of swords in reverse is definitely um, reconciliation. Okay, overcoming problems. Okay, want to come back together. Okay, S suppressing memories, um, releasing the pain, and wanting to be a union again, whether it's a friend, whatever it is. They, they, nostalgic energy. They're thinking about you a whole lot about the past. <clears throat> the Knight of Wands is Leo Sagittarius, Aries energy. Okay, so yeah, I, I feel like, ooh. I don't know if somebody left because somebody was being in a hole, somebody broke up. Or say, I don't, this is, the Knight of Wands is Leo Sagittarius Aries energy. This is, the night is always moving and leaving. So the hangman is someone feeling confined and letting go and feeling trapped. And it's because of lack of direction. And the Queen of Wands is someone that was sleeping around or lying or cheating as a friend or stealing from you or the job that lied on you. Or it's some type of energy of um, unfaithfulness, liar, you know, vengeful. You see? So you got somebody showing up as the knight, someone showing up as the queen of wands. I don't know which one you are. I'm assuming, you, I don't know if, you, if the person you're dealing with or uh, a job you're dealing with, you know, it's front on you because somebody that's new, that's a lion, that's stealing from the job. It can be, take it as a resume. Shit. It's everywhere with this thing I'm reading. <laughs> Generals be everywhere. Take it as a resume. Okay. Okay. Any other messages here? Let me see. Yeah. Um, yeah. I feel like someone sees you. Oh yeah. Someone sees you getting your shit together. The Queen of Pentacles is Virgo towards Capricorn energy. This is your energy. Someone wants to offer you a, 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 a love proposal, a job proposal, a love offer, some type of commitment. The Knight of 
it's a small love offer. It's a small. It's not the job of your dreams or the. You feel like I could do better because it's a night. So it's like it's not mature enough or the person or the situation. But it's not that bad with the queen of the, with the queen of pentacles. It's you got some type of knight of cups showing up. Romantic offer. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. Okay, and then you got the four cups. It's Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy, and it is upright. This is like daydream, regret, remorse. Okay, boredom. Um, focus on the negative. Okay, and I feel like something's coming your way. And there's the death card right after that. Okay, at the end of the the death card is Scorpio energy. The death card is letting go of something, the new beginning of something. This is um transition, okay? Unexpected upheaval of change in a good way. Some dark energy you're releasing. So some of you could be going through the dark night of, the dark night of the shadow. And maybe that's what you're releasing or someone around you is. I'm not sure. Okay, guys, I am Phoenix Rising. This has been your general read. Leos, click like, subscribe, share me, come back and see me. I love you guys. I'm sending you love and light. I thank you guys for watching. Um, don't forget to hit that notification bell, that like button, and that subscribe button. It helps support the channel. I thank you guys. I'm sending you freaking love and light. Till next time, I'm out of here. I'm Phoenix. Bye.